Hello everyone, welcome back. So today we're doing another project with the deer antlers that I got from my brother Danny over at uh, TN Deer Stalker Outdoors. And today it's gonna be a match safe. So we got, I think, 13 matches in there. So we'll leave those in there. So I have a spare one over here. And when I was playing around with it, I did get it to strike off the bottom. So let's see if it does. And here you go. So we got a little match safe. Let's get to it. All right, so we're going to start by cutting off the um, base of the antler here. I just have a piece of leather in my vise so I don't crush it up. And I'm just going to use plain old hacksaw. There you go. Now this will make a nice giant button. So we'll save that. So now we're going to cut this off. I would say right about here. Because we're going to clean this up. We'll cut this off and clean it up. Alright, now I'm going to do the same thing here, I'm just going to cut that off, and then I'll bring you back to the table. Alright, so here's what we got. Now I'm going to put this back in the vise, and we're going to drill out the center. And hopefully, don't ruin it. So I have here a Forstner bit. I never used the Forstner bit on a drill antler on a uh, antler, but we're going to give it a shot. Oh, there it goes. All right, I'll continue with that and I'll bring you back. All right, so I got the hole done. That's a 5 eighth inch hole and it goes down to about there now using that force in a bit was it was too tough but it was good that I had about a half an inch down which kind of you know made a channel then I used a half an inch regular twist drill went straight down and went through it like butter and then I chased it with the uh, the force in a bit okay so now I'm gonna flatten the bottom I just clean this up a little bit. I don't want to take off too much of this texture because I want it, you know, to look like an antler. So uh, I'll get at it. All right, so you get the idea. I'll keep flattening that until I have it sit uh, exactly the way I want it. And then I'll take this and I'll run this and smooth that out a little bit and I'll bring you back. All right, quick recap. So we drilled a hole, we cleaned up, flattened the bottom, flattened the top. Now what you didn't see was I made this out of that base that I said would make a good button. Um, I thought I was hit record, but I didn't. So it's just roughed out. 
and this is going to be our lid. And what I did was I just drilled a hole in it. And this is the regular screw that I uh, file flat. And this fits in here. I think that looks nice. And then I just took a piece of cedar, uh, put it in my drill, and ran it on my belt grinder to make this little plug. And then this will fit on here. And I'll epoxy that in. And then this will fit on here. Okay? So now I'm just going to take this over to the... Um, Actually, I'll probably do it with my Dremel. I'm going to attach this together, then I'm going to put this in, and then I'm going to refine the cap. All right, I'll take you over there. All right, so I just got a little uh, sanding disc on here. And we'll just clean up. We'll just clean this up. All right. As you can see, I didn't make it perfectly round or anything because we want to have that very organic look. All right, I'll bring you back over to the table. All right, so here's a close up. And again, you could go crazy. You could smooth this out make it perfectly round and polish it and get a nice shine but i'm, I'm just going for that rustic look um we're not going to be polishing this so i'm not going to polish this we got our matches let's see how many we got two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12, a baker's dozen, I think that'll work, because then they'll come out easy, you take your top, put it on, and there you have it, an antler match safe, So everyone, thanks for watching. I really appreciate your views and I appreciate all your comments. And Danny, my brother, again, thank you for the uh, antlers. I absolutely love it. Um, got a few more ideas, but uh, this one popped into my head and I kind of like it. Um, and these are Strike Anywhere matches. I did strike them on the antler and it worked, but it's pretty tough. Let's see if I can get one to go off. Nah. Oh, there you go. Hey, look at that. How awesome is that? Right off the bottom. Sweet. Well, there you go. There's another reason not to polish it. That worked great. All right. So where was I? So, Danny, thanks, brother. I really appreciate it. And I, I thank all of you, like always, uh, from the bottom of my heart. You all, um, you warm my heart. You make my day. I hope you all are having a great, great day and staying safe. And uh, we'll see you on the next one.